to shake your booties for black girl nerds. Hey. Hi. Hi. Uh, how are you guys doing this morning? Good. That makes sense. Good. 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 Okay. So, um, jump right in. So, season two seems to be a lot about well, themes love and loss, mm. and de and dealing with it, um, both actually. So, I, I I'm just going to throw this out to everybody, Cancer, in terms of your characters, the biggest um, impact of the loss and how it affects the love in your character's life. Um. <laughs> well, I, so for me, it's Sam playing um, that storyline. I lost my father right. not too long ago, so, um, and Yvette Lee Bowser and Matt Stern, who wrote that episode, Code Together, um, they mm -hmm. have had deep loss in their lives, and uh, it was just, it's something I think we all experience on, on a different level, and so I just appreciated having a, an opportunity to, um, to express all of the parts of that, and a big part of that was the sisterhood, the mm -hmm. three women going home together, the unlikely grouping. Um, it's it's really important when you're going through a loss to have people you supporting you. I think for Joelle, um, I think it was the loss of a partner that she thought might be great for her. Mm -hmm. um, and it sounds, you know, it seems like she was only dating him for a little while, but I, I think that's really what Joelle desires and she knows that she deserves. And as soon as it, as he, Trevor comes into her life, he's almost gone as fast as he came. Um, but then, like, the silver lining is, like, you know, then Reggie kind of steps up, who is really who she's always really cared about. Um, and so that's kind of where the love comes back in. A love that she was starting to let go, but then he stepped up, and so it kind of made... It made it all a little bit brighter for her because I think she was pretty sad. Mm. Yeah. Um, mm -hmm. I would say for Reggie, <clears throat> anyway, uh, season one was like a loss of his facade, and um, yeah, after yeah. the you know after episode five, mm -hmm. and then the wound was there. There was trauma. There was a wound, and so with season two, um, he's trying to get back to his self. Um, and fill that wound with love. Now, through therapy, through prayer, through drugs, through sex, <laughs> yeah. he hasn't found the proper um, method yet, but yeah. He will. But he's on that journey. We he's on the journey, him. for yeah. sure. Yeah. <clears throat> I don't know. I mean, I just think Gabe is in a constant place of growth. I think he's, I think one of his like strong suits is him being open to, you know, to, kind of admit that he's that he doesn't know what he's talking about um, so I feel like what he lost in a positive way was um, I don't know I, I'm trying to I, I, that's something I haven't really thought about I just feel like he I, th I feel like in season in, in season two he grows a lot because he gets called out on a lot of the way that he views the world that he thought was like a positive influence and um, I mean, of course, like he lost his, but well, he may have thought he lost his love with Sam, mm -hmm. you know? Uh, Do you think maybe a loss of innocence, possibly, or some innocence? Yeah, and well, I mean, he knowledge. carries a lot of guilt from, you know, episode mm -hmm. five and what happened to Reggie. And I think, yeah, I think he lost a part of himself in the always being able to do the right thing. And now, you know, him being able to cope with that and how that affects, you know, how it's affected people that he cares about in a negative way, I think. Uh, yeah, but you know, he found he found his I think they're I think they love each other. Can you just a quick one word what you hope for your character most in season three? One word. Okay. Probably. Healing. Mm. Um just get me, I'll come back. <laughs> Support. Growth. Okay. Back to you. Reconciliation. Come on now. Good. Yeah, you got a lot to reconcile. Girl. <laughs> 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 Come on. Better shake your booties for black girl nerds. Better shake your booties for black girl nerds.